Hi, thanks for joining me. Uh, Play on Go here. Um, today I want to do some shoutouts. This is something that I haven't really done before, and I think what has prompted me to do it is that I've started following some uh, YouTubers uh, recently, um, just finding some new channels. Some people have started doing videos that weren't doing videos before, um, and I've just you know been finding some people that are you know maybe they're kind of new or they don't have as many subs as I think that they should. So I just wanted to highlight those guys um, because I'm enjoying watching them. In case uh, you guys would enjoy it too. Um, I also remember being shouted out um, when I was first starting my channel by the completionist, and uh, I just remember that that really meant a lot to me, and, and I thought it was cool, so I wanted to return the favor. So um, to start off with, um, I'm going to talk about Crack Lotus. This is uh, somebody who started watching my channel pretty recently. Um, you know, time flies. It's probably been a little while now, maybe uh, you know, month, month, two months, something like that. Um, but uh, he's been commenting a lot on my videos. I've really been enjoying just the, the back and forth, kind of responding to comments. And this is a little bit of an apology, too, because I had commented back and I was like, hey, I subbed your videos, you know. Um, and then I was waiting around for weeks and I'm kind of like, man, I'm, you know, is he going to post a video? And um, nothing was showing up in my feed. And it turns out that something happened. I think YouTube unsubscribed me or. Um, for whatever reason, you weren't in my subs list, so I've resubscribed and uh, you know definitely solved that problem. A really interesting guy to listen to, a lot of fun. Um, you know, he he's done a variety of videos. He's only been doing this for about six months, it seems like. Um, but he and I share some really similar tastes. Um, I don't think so much in like Japanese import games, I don't really think he's an import gamer, but uh, he's a huge Nipponichi fan, so all of Nipponichi's um, you know, US releases, and he just did a video about like games that are coming up that he has pre-ordered, uh, the stuff that he's interested in, a lot of overlap with the stuff that I'm looking forward to, so um, very cool to to, uh, to chat with about games, and uh, definitely somebody I recommend that you check out, Crack Lotus. Um, the next one is Gogo Sega Gaga, um, another longtime viewer of this channel. Uh, he just started making videos. Uh, he's been doing it for about a month, and um, really have been enjoying watching those videos. Um, you know, he's very soft-spoken. Uh, obviously, a Sega fan and, and a Dreamcast fan. So we've already had some cool like Dreamcast uh, videos coming up. But um, but you know not. Just that it seems like he's uh, you know, he's a gamer. He's getting back into gaming a little bit, some kind of retro stuff. He just picked up an N64, and it was really fun to hear him reminisce about having had one originally and the stuff that he just picked up for it and stuff like that. So um, very very cool. I uh, definitely recommend you check him out. Um, the only thing that I would warn you about is the audio is a is a little uh, spotty still. But like I said, he's just starting out, so uh, uh, definitely recommend Gogo Sega Gaga. Uh, the next one, somebody I found recently, um, this is 3AM Game Vids, and I don't think he and I have had any sort of social interaction. If we have and you're watching this, I apologize. It's possible you commented on my videos and I watched your stuff, and, but um, I think I just found it through searching. But um, he covers the most eclectic, you know, weird, interesting mix of video games. They all seem kind of obscure, but really high quality. And he covers like Japanese imports. Um, he covered like um, Criminal Girls, which is is something that I'll be probably talking about a little bit more here. Um, but I mean, just ran like he did this amazing video on an Elder Scrolls game on the N gauge. You know, um, he's done like interviews with people in the games industry and all kinds of stuff. His videos are always really well done. Like he does um, captures footage, does voiceover. You know, very professional sounding, but not not like overly professional. Um, I just think they're a really good mix of just quality and content. And um, he definitely, you know, he doesn't get as many views uh, and, and subs as uh, I think he deserves for those. So um, definitely recommend you check him out. Um, the next one, actually somebody I've been watching for a little while. His name is Michael Rowland. Um, I've commented on like his past couple of videos. Uh, I just really enjoy like listening to him talk about uh, video games and, and other stuff too. Um, he did a video recently on Attack on Titan. Um, he just sort of talked about his impressions of the first half of the series. 
So uh, definitely some parallels there, there in terms of new stuff, like when I was getting my PlayStation 4, he was getting one, he was talking about the controller, talking about next gen. Um, but not only that, I mean, he's also a retro gamer. Uh, it sounds like he has a really big PS2 collection. Um, he also, you know, some of our interests overlap in terms of, you know, I remember him talking about picking up, like, uh, Folklore and... Um, yeah, Hyperdimension Neptunia Mark II and stuff like that. So um, just a just a really cool guy to listen to. Uh, I really like seeing like the stuff he's got up in his room. He's got like a, three really nice looking guitars like hanging in the background now and stuff. So uh, I know he did a, an update video and he said he's kind of busy. He's doing some writing for a, a blog. So um, you know his videos like his can be a little spotty in terms of how how often he posts. So I'm I'm just hoping this is kind of my plea. You know, Michael. Keep making your videos because I like watching them. Uh, and definitely, you know, a little, little interaction in the comments would be nice too. Um, I definitely recommend you check him out. Um, last up is, um, and sh forgive me if I screw this up, we're talking uh, Oracon or Orthrecon or something. I'm not sure uh, how you uh, want to say that. But um, definitely uh, somebody who's been watching my channel, somebody who's been commenting. Uh, somebody very knowledgeable about Japanese, and um, he's just started posting some like video game related videos in the past like m one month, basically the past few weeks, and uh, they're really cool. He he's done a little bit on uh, Occubus Trip and some stuff on Black Rock Shooter, and it's just is really fun to listen to him you know, explain, like, about some of the terms and the language that some of the characters are using in, in Japanese and stuff like that. Uh, really looking forward to seeing uh, some more videos from him about, um, you know, Japanese games, uh, import games, and kind of, especially, like, the language involved in them. But anything, really, you know, he's he just did a video about uh, the Ace Attorney series, which I haven't checked out, but I'm just really looking forward to, you know, hearing him talk uh, some more about games. Uh, very cool guy. Um, so I definitely recommend that you check out um, or three con. <laughs> so um, yeah, that's that's about it. Uh, I just wanted to shout out some some people that I've you know started watching recently. Um, definitely going to be doing some more videos here. So keep an eye on my channel. Um, thanks so much for watching. And, and you know the other thing I want to say is um, it's tough doing these because I feel like you know you leave people out you know there are so many people I want to thank for um, for watching my videos and commenting and you know just for putting up the stuff that they put up on YouTube you know all, all the people that I watch are, are really amazing so um, you know I know you got to the end of this video anybody but those five people and I didn't talk about you um, I just want to say thank you to to everybody else uh, I really really appreciate all your support and you know all the the good content that you guys make so that's all thanks for watching see you later